गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स स्टार्ट अ न्यू लेसन बैंक्स एंड सिंपल इंटरेस्ट लेसन नंबर टेन व्हाट यू अंडरस्टैंड बाय बैंक बैंक इज अ गवर्नमेंट रिकॉग्नाइज इंस्टीट्यूशन दैट कैरीज आउट फिनेंशियल ट्रांसैक्शंस और आल्सो यू कैन से दैट एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन व्हिच कीप्स मनी सेफली फॉर इट्स कस्टमर्स द ऑफिस ऑफ बिल्डिंग ऑफ सच एन ऑर्गेनाइजेशन You can take money out, save, borrow, or exchange money at a bank. There are different types of account: current account, saving account, recurring deposit account, and fixed deposit account. What do you mean by current account? A current account is mainly for traders and those dealing in money on a daily basis. an account holder can deposit or withdraw money any number of times in a day the bank does not pay any interest on the money in this type of account current account are very popular among company firm public enterprises businessmen who generally have higher number of regular transactions with the bank The current account includes deposit, withdrawals, and contra transactions. The next one is saving account. A person can deposit a minimum amount and open a saving account. The bank pays some interest on the basis of the daily credit balance in the account. There are some restrictions on how often money can be withdrawn from this account. In simple terms, a saving account is a bank offers service which allows you to store your money while earning interest on your contribution. The next one is recurring deposit account. In this account, depositor deposits a certain amount every month for a specified period. Example: twelve months, eighteen months, etc. The bank gives an interest on the deposit, which is more than that paid for the saving account. After the maturity period, the depositor gets the principal with interest. A recurring deposit is a special kind of term deposit offered by bank, which helps people with regular incomes to deposit a fixed amount every month into their recurring deposit. account and earn interest at the rate applicable to fixed deposit the next one is fixed deposit a depositor deposits a certain amount for a fixed period in the bank this deposit attracts a greater rate of interest than the saving account however these rates are different in different banks senior citizens get a slightly greater rate of interest than the usual fixed deposit is investment instrument offered by bank where you can deposit money for a higher rate of interest than saving account you can deposit a lump sum of money in fixed deposit for a specific period the another few important things are atm credit and debit cards an atm automatic teller machine card is used to withdraw cash without going to a bank what is credit card or debit card a credit card or debit card is used to carry out transaction without using cash an account holder can get such a card on request to to the bank the another most important thing is passbook a passbook is issued for a saving account and a recurring deposit account amount deposited withdrawn and the balance are record recorded in it with their dates there's an specimen shown over here you can see that on 2nd feb 2016 Fifteen hundred cash has been deposited. On eighth Feb two thousand sixteen, a check of five thousand has been deposited. So all these entries comes in this passbook. 
Now for this lesson, we need some formulas to be learned. The simple interest and the amount. Here, P stands for principal, I stands for interest, R stands for rate of interest, and T, time in years. The formula for interest is P into R into T upon 100. That is principal into rate of interest into time in years upon 100. This is the formula we use to find interest. And to find amount, we need to plus principal plus interest. Thank you.